Hey guys, welcome to my channel, Mark Combat. Today I wanted to do a guide on Fujin's Variation Downburst, which is the one that I've been using the most since the new DLC Aftermath came out. Okay, first let's look at the best ways to punish a negative attack. This one is a meterless. That's a 26% meterless. If we want to span a bar, we can do this. And span that at the end. It'll be a 29%. If I wanted to spend two bars to finish the opponent, we'll meter burn it two times over here, and then do the flying kicks, and that will be 30, 35.9. That will be a 36%, basically. But keep in mind, it wastes two meter bars. I only recommend to do that if you know you're gonna kill the opponent. Now, with this move, this will be the combo that I would do. That's a 28%. Just one meter. If we want to spend two meters on this combo, this is how it looks. It will only hit one time, which is only 30%, which is not that good for two meters combo. If I was gonna be using this light, I would use this combo. 28% combo, almost 29. Again, if you want to spend the bar at the end, it's just your option, you're, you're not gonna get that much. Only at 30%. Now this move, which is the back two, can also do a combo. A very good 25%. Instead of doing this, which is only a 12%. This move, we could also do a meterless combo, which is pretty good. There you go, a 20, 23%. If you wanted to spend a bar on this move, you could do it like this. That would be a 26%, almost 27. Now, if we use this move, we could do a meterless combo. Of a 26%. If you want to spend two bars in the tornado to get the extra damage, you can do this. And get a 35%. In the corner, we can spend the meter and get more damage. Twenty-eight percent. The same thing with this move. You can spend the meter with a slide too. We'll be at almost twenty-nine percent. With this move too. Twenty nine percent. Okay, let's see his crushing blows now and how to get the most damage out of it. The first one I want to show you is this one, one one of four. The requirements are punish or a counter hit. That's a twenty eight percent. Now with the uppercut crushing blow we could do this meterless combo which is a 40% meterless combo only only using the crushing blow if we want to spend two bars to get the most damage it will be like this it will be a 47% with the uppercut crushing blow and 2 meter. Now remember, all these combos could always end up in a restun, which is a very good situation. That's a restun right there. And a 35% damage. With this crushing blow, we could do this. A 36% combo, 1 meter, and 1 crushing blow. If we get a hit with this crushing blow, it could be a 34 meter less. If you want to spend 2 bars, it will be a 41%. 
Okay, so now I'm gonna show you how to combine all these combos with the Fatal Blow of Fujin. Try to get the max amount of damage. Now Fujin also has some good mix-ups, for example you can use the slide and the hop, that's a low and an overhead. Not many people are gonna react to that, eventually they will if you keep doing him the mash. But keep in mind you can always do this, cancel and go for a pressure or go for a throw, whatever you decide to do. 
Remember the requirement for this crushing blow is to remain in the air for a little bit. And then we can do it and do our combo. Now remember, this move has a low in the second hit. We can cancel in the first one to an overhead. That's another mix-up right there. But this move also has a low at the end. Hope the video was helpful and thank you all for watching guys.